Now let's get into the bass clef. The bass clef is going to follow some of the same rules. We're going to start down at this G down here in the bass clef. G. Then a D. Then a D. Clef. And an A. So what we say to remember this is good, always, do, fine, always. So once again, that's good, always, do, fine, always. So that's how we remember the lines for the bass clef. And we can see them down at the bottom. So how we do the, the spaces is A, C, E, G. And what we say for that one is all, cows eat grass because they all really do eat grass all cows eat grass so to repeat the treble clef is going to be every good boy does fine f a c e face the bass clef is good boys do fine always and all cows eat so it's like a staircase. So I can start from here, these two seeds. And when I walk in, one note at a time, you see they're both making their way back to middle C. So both hands make their way back to middle C. And I can go, that's called contrary motion, or we can go ascending motion. Ascending motion means I'm going up. And you see how you go from line to space. And that's how you simply read the notes. It's no magic spell. That's how you read the notes. So treble clef lines, spaces, bass clef lines and spaces. Take your time and review and practice. And you'll learn how to read music in no time. Peace.